Um, next up, we've got uh, Mojita Dadley uh, from Great Exploitations. And Mojita, forgive me if I pronounced your name at all wrong, but you're very welcome here as well. Another fantastic group in the UK that's uh, on the backs of the greyhound industry. So over to you. Thank you. Um, I'm, as you've just heard, I'm here representing Great Exploitations, and Great Exploitations would like to thank Aaron for organising this important event, bringing so many advocates from across the world to unite for, in one cause for the support of Greyhounds and what an amazing job Aaron has done and for all of you for turning up to support. The reason why we are here is not so heartwarming. Despite the decline of Greyhound racing in, here in Ireland, but mainly in the UK, the Irish racing industry is still overbreeding Greyhounds. While the homing scheme falls far short of what is required to ensure the welfare of thousands of greyhounds once deemed no use as a betting product or as a breeding product. Not content with failing innocent greyhounds in this country, the industry is actively condoning the export of greyhounds to Macau, as you now know, where their death is 100% certain once they can no longer compete and can no longer earn their keep. The racing industry worldwide depends on overbreeding and destruction of healthy greyhounds for their profits. The export of greyhounds to countries where there are no welfare laws, such as China, where no um, homing schemes exist, highlights the desperation of a dying industry that has no place in modern society. We ask the Irish government to not only place an immediate ban on the export of racing greyhounds, but to also fund and implement a national homing scheme promoting greyhounds as companion animals in this country. Surely a life after racing is the least these sentient creatures deserve, after making millions of euros profit for the bedding industry and also revenue from the, for the Irish government. Quote Pope Francis, our, our indifference or cruelty towards fellow creatures of this world, sooner or later, affects the treatment we meet out to other human beings. I made the journey here not only to represent great exploitations, uh, I also came here to represent my Irish Greyhound, who's a loved member of my family, and also the people from 56 countries who joined a small project that I started in the last three weeks. I mean, you, we have 56 countries supporting the Irish Greyhounds who want the exportation of Irish Greyhounds to countries with no welfare to stop. Yeah. Yeah, I asked the Irish government to show compassion to Greyhounds, these wonderful gentle souls who give so much to so many of us. Please, don't send them to countries like China where they will be killed. Thank you very much. Thank you. This is well, Mojita, here we go.